new video could taste toy. Well, that didn't last long. <laughs> Anyways, uh, the following video contains toys getting smashed by a hammer by a trained professional. So needless to say, viewer discretion is advised and don't try this at home. Also, you can leave a comment down below about us smashing toys. We paid it for them. We can do whatever we want with them. But anyways, you can still comment if you want. It's still going to be funny. But anyways, on to the video. Listen up Rangers, welcome to Geek Chess. My name is Arnez and today we have a special versus video for you guys. It is multiple figures at once that we're going to smash. And what this is, is just my collection of DBZ stuff that I've gotten over the time. This was supposed to be an 8 inch Vegeta figure that I paid $22 for. And this is what I got. I don't think that's even 8 inches, or 8 millimeters, centimeters. Pissed. Got this, because I always thought uh, Super Saiyan 4 or Super Saiyan GT was just trash. And it was like $2 at GameStop on clearance. Got it, and it's been sitting in a box since then. I think I like open it once or twice. Same thing with this. I was so pissed off I got this that it just ended up being in trash. Like, not trash, but ended up being just displayed there. But it is trash, so we're going to smash it, make myself feel better. And the piece resistance here is the Pop Animated Daddy Yamcha Summer Convention Limited Edition Funko 2018 figure. This is special. This is going to be fun. I hope you guys are Dragon Ball Z fans. So what I'm going to do is start with the small guy, work my way up, and last guy will be this guy that we're going to smash. Eh, maybe these guys cost a little bit, I don't know. I should probably find out, see what their price value is. I'm going to set these guys aside. I'm going to start with the little one and work my way up. Dead Yamcha can stay over there. Ah, another thing where our ass got gypped on. Damn. Oh, that was actually kind of epic. I don't know if you guys seen that. That crap flew everywhere. Whoa. Let me go see if I can find the body pieces. Found a leg actually right next to me. And Kirito's arm. I think that's a leg. I don't remember. Yes, it is. In my misadventures for looking for pieces, I found an arm, Kirito's arm, and the translucent Godzilla tail. This is hilarious. Gotta add this to the trash. Or the pile that we're gonna make a custom figure out of. I'll push this guy aside. Next, what we got here is my $2 clearance. Dragon Ball GT figure. I always bought this because I really wanted to smash it. And now, may all my dreams come true. If you never watched Dragon Ball GT, for love of God, please do not. You want to talk about nonsense and trash, you should watch that. Trust me, it is bad. Any true Dragon Ball Z fan will tell you that Dragon Ball GT is trash. Oh crap. Flew everywhere. Ah, there we go. Let me see what I can find over here. Ouch! I gotta be careful. But that was so worth it. This piece survived. That is unacceptable. I did find a leg though. Gosh, look at these crap joints. <laughs> yes!
Um, I can't find the other piece of body. It flew somewhere. Gives a whole new definition of let the bodies hit the floor. This one actually just ripped at the joint. So to this part. This one actually got damaged pretty good. We'll see how that works out. Clean this out of the way. So now, what we have here is the 2018 Summer Convention Limited Edition Dead Yamcha figure. I looked it up online and he sells for about $25. People are asking anywhere between $30 and up. Last few that I looked sells for about $25. Bucks. So it's not bad for pop figure. I mean, some of these pop figures can go for thousands of dollars. It's crazy. But overall, I think Steve got this. And it was just a funny concept of Dead Yamcha because he dies like almost every episode. I don't know how it's even possible. But this is just a humor character in that show. He dies every freaking season, almost every episode, in every way possible. Gets blown up, stabbed, shot, everything. So, without further ado... Nah, I can't do that. So, what I'm going to do... If you are a true Dragon Ball Z fan and you're interested in this, let me know in a comment below because I will be doing the giveaway of this guy. And like I said before, Pop Figure, Yamcha, if you're interested, please let me know down below. You have to make sure you like the video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, and make sure you just type PS in the comment section. With that, I will pick after, I'll give it about two weeks after this video comes out, and then I'll pick a random person who met the criteria and I will give this figure away. I will make an announcement winning video and then we'll go from there. Just please make sure you're of the age. And if you are under the age, make sure that it's okay with your parents. Because if you are a picked winner, you will have to give a random people your address. So you have to make sure... I don't want to get yelled at about somebody's parents because they did not talk to them first. If you're interested in this, let me know. Type in yes and hit that like and subscribe to the channel. And I will give this bad boy away. Like I said before, I'm not an unreasonable monster. I just break stuff that I don't like. I don't have room for display anymore or if it's like broken or something else. Or unless you guys specifically request. There's been somebody requesting for us to do the Shin Playmates. We are going to do it. It's just taking some time because Steve has been sick lately. So we can't get together to do it because he wants to be part of that video, which is completely understandable. That will be a fun video to do. Again, interested? Yes, like, subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe button. And I'll see you guys later. And always thank you guys for participating in our giveaways. I love you guys. And I appreciate you. And I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. In all this excitement, I almost forgot to nail my pieces to the wall. I was a little worried there for a second. What I got here, or the piece that I will nail, is the Super Saiyan 4 tail from Vegeta. Hopefully it works. Yeah. Where are we going to put this bad boy? Right here. Or I'm going to try to put it right there. Wow, that's a pain in the butt. And for the little guy, I'm going to nail his leg. Because that is the only piece that I have that did not explode and fly away. I have no idea where the rest of the parts are. I tried to find them. 
Ow. I just hammered my finger. It's okay, you can laugh if it's funny. Boom, there you go. Anyways, since this is the ending of the video, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.